Alright, I think I've finally got the capture card set up. Now, any sound you hear from the computer is being picked up by the microphone because the capture card won't capture from two different sources at the same time. And I did try to see if I could do it through the stereo mix, but that didn't really work very well and just caused a load of feedback problems. So this is the best I'm able to do at the moment with what I've got. I think it's good enough. So Windows 98 turned 25 last month. And I was intending to make this video last month, but I didn't quite get around to it because I had to get my computer out of the uh, cupboard and then set it all up. So this is a real machine. This isn't a virtual machine. It's the real deal. Because I don't really like virtual machines because they never replicate the hardware. You can't replicate the hardware. The only way to get the hardware is to have the hardware. So let's go on here. You can see this is actually running second edition and that's because that's what's installed on here because it is the better version and I'm not... I can't be bothered to install the original 98 just for one video. It's practically the same, it's just got, well, quite a few improvements, most noticeably uh, better USB support. You can see here I've got 512 megabytes of RAM, which is the maximum RAM you can use with Windows 98. Some people have managed to get uh, 786 megabytes working, but... From what I've heard, it's quite buggy. Like, for all intents and purposes, 512 is the maximum. And I've got a uh, Pentium 4 processor. Where is it? It should be on system devices, shouldn't it? It's not going to show it here, is it? But, yeah, it's a Pentium 4. You can see I've got a... Uh, where is it? Display adapters, of course. This is a GeForce 256 in here, which I, uh, you know, I replaced the one that was in this one, which was a... it was a newer... Uh, Radeon card, but it wasn't very compatible with some of the games I wanted to play. So, yeah, I've just got a GeForce 256, which I didn't even realise that was the first GeForce card. I just, I just wanted to get hold of an older one, and so I got I managed to get the 256. Apparently it's quite rare now. The Voodoo is better though. But the Voodoo cards... <clears throat> I, I tried putting a Voodoo card in here. Uh, but it wouldn't fit in the slot because it's, the, it's a different voltage. And there were like two different voltages. I think it's like 1.5 volt and 3 uh, volt cards. They have like the different slots. Uh, the watches, because you can't put one in the other. And there's not many. I think only the. Yeah, only the G. Only the, the Voodoo 4. Uh, for. 4500 can go in either voltage. Anyway, let's let's uh, get on to the point of this video. Um, I haven't I haven't actually got internet on here because there's no Ethernet card installed. 
I could if I wanted to, but I didn't really want to open it all up. And I'm probably going to do a video on Windows Me, which that does have an Ethernet card. And is nearly as old as this anyway, which will show you that you can still use the internet with this. It's just that most websites don't support the old browsers. That's all it is. If they still supported... If the old browsers still supported the newer, uh, like, HTML, then you'd be able to browse the internet on here just fine. Now, one of the things I love about 98... See, 98 is my favourite operating system, because that's what I grew up on. And it's still the best because it's so simple. You go on Start Menu, you find if you want to go on Control Panel, there's your Control Panel. Unlike on Windows 10, where you have to go through several different windows just to get to the Control Panel. And then Device Manager is easy. You just go in System, Device Manager, there you go. All your stuff's in here. Desktop themes, that's something that's missing. From the newer version of Windows. You can also right click on the My Computer shortcut and get to the same system properties with Device Manager. And yes, I do like the fact that it's My Computer, not this PC. I don't know why they changed that. Some people say, like, oh, because it's not always your computer that you're using. Well, actually, it still makes sense because it's my computer that I'm using. Like, I don't see what the big deal is. My computer that I am currently using, is it really that much of an issue? Also, don't tell Adobe, but I've got an old version of Photoshop which I still haven't really bothered to use but I've just got the disc for it I haven't actually got the discs installed for any of these so I can't really show you but I might do a, I might do some separate videos on them maybe I definitely want to do some videos on some obs more obscure software that I've still got Yeah, this video isn't really very structured, I'm just, it, it's also a test for the capture card, and I'm just trying to go through, like, I'm just saying why Windows 98 is better, and it is 25 years old now, so I think it deserves a bit of praise. It was so customizable. I mean, I know you can still customize the sounds, but like you had desktop themes. Garfield was what we had on ours. One of these sounds, I've heard it recently, it's like, I don't actually know if people found it from this. Where is it? Where is it? There was this sound, it goes oink. That's the one. I don't know if people have found that from this or whether that sound was from something else, but I've I've heard that I've heard people playing that sound in game. It seems to be on people's soundboards now. Oh, uh, where's the uh star windows, yeah. what I always used to hear. 
I don't think there's really much more to say in this, and I don't want this to go on too long. I'm I'm just like having a, another look through and testing the capture card. But yeah, that's. I've I've also got some other videos I want to do about this, um, which I I've thought of. Um, I was considering making a new channel for it, but I might just go ahead and do it on this channel because I'm probably not going to be using YouTube much longer anyway. I already, like, didn't use it for a whole year, and then I only came back because people wanted a few more videos. And it's the only place to really... Uh, talk about stuff where people are actually gonna people are actually around to listen there's no point going on some other site that no one's really paying attention to unless you you're talking about specific things that people who go on to those sites are interested in this is probably going on far too long so I'm gonna turn it off right now but uh thanks for listening if you if you're still watching